today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to recharge your batteries on your golf cart manually. If you've left them off the charger, the trickle charger over the winter, and now you can't even get your normal golf cart charger to start charging the batteries because they've gone so low. This is an old Sears car charger, and this is 12 volt but this will be able to work, which is great. So even if you have a lower amperage than this, the 12 volt will work. And we do have right in front of us here, a 48 volt golf cart. That means that there are literally six batteries in here. Now, as you can see here with the 48 volt, you're gonna get two going this direction. You're gonna get two going this direction and then you're gonna get two going this direction. So my buddy's golf cart, unfortunately, when you plug in the charger, they are not being able to charge. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna manually charge these. So what we got here is, again, these are eight volt batteries each, but the 12 volt charger will not fully charge them, but it will get it up enough so that your charger can start to charge them if you've left them over the winter time. So right here we have again, eight and eight. So we have 16. So we're gonna charge these with the 12 volt. And let me show you now how we're gonna do that and how long we're gonna do it for. And then we're gonna move on to the next set here. All right, so as we can see here, here is our two first set right here. We're going to go in line. That is going to again only charge it 12 volts. We're going to do 30 minute sessions and then we're going to move to the next set here. So as you can see here, this battery is our starting one here. We are going to go the positive up here to the negative down here on the second one here. We're going to do that for 30 minutes. When 30 minutes is up, we are then going to go to this set in the middle here. We are then going to move the red one to the positive right here on the first one. And then we are going to jump to the negative on the negative one, 30 more minutes on that set. Lastly, we're going to head over here to this one and put the positive on the positive and then the negative over here to the negative on that one. So it's that is in series as well for 30 minutes. So that right there is an hour and a half of charging. And then we are gonna be doing it two more times after that for a total of three times. So make sure that you set a timer so you're not overcharging and hurting your batteries. So right now my charger is in the off position and then you clamp them and then you wanna turn it on and then after the half an hour, turn the charger off, declamp them, clamp them back on the second set like I just showed you, and then turn the charger on so that it's not hot while you are locking on. You don't wanna get some sparks and electrocute yourself. If you are trying to use your charger from your golf cart after you've done that, they should be up and running and your charger should kick on after that. Unfortunately, if this does not work, you can either try it again or your batteries might have gone bad because they went too low. You're not guaranteed that this will work, but this potentially could work for you, and I hope it does. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching the video. Thumbs that up. If it has helped you, subscribe on your way out, guys, and I will link some golf cart batteries in the description box below if you feel like purchasing them or need to purchase batteries. Look for that in the description box below. We'll see you guys on the next one. Take care. Bye-bye. Don't let the party stop, guys. Hit one of these videos. Continue to watch. We'll see you soon. Thank you.